Loved ones say he was bullied to death. They sat on him. Um, they pushed him around. They just, they were terrible to him. And now police are investigating whether someone should be held accountable for his suicide. Denver 7 starts right now. Jack Padilla's death is a tragedy, and now police are looking into whether it was also a crime. The Cherry Creek High School student took his own life earlier this year, and tonight his mother says she has evidence that his classmates drove him to do it. Denver 7's Jackie Cray spoke with grieving friends about Jack and just what he endured. It's not only a death, it's suicide. Suicide, it comes with so much guilt. It comes with so many questions. And it's really hard to comprehend that your friend would really want to die. Jack Padilla was only here for 15 short years. A freshman at Cherry Creek High School, his friends Giovanni and Nina will tell you he left a huge impact. He was quirky, athletic, and not scared of anything. Just any way that he could express himself, he did. He had struggled before with depression, his friends say, but things became severely dark for him when students at school bullied him. They sat on him. Um, they pushed him around. They just, they were terrible to him. He took his life in February on Valentine's Day. I thought I knew him so well. And then, like, I didn't even have any idea that this was coming. Weeks later, in a public Facebook post, his mother, Janine Padilla, shared a message saying, our family needs healing prayers. We want to be able to remember the many happy memories we shared with our son, Jack, and to one day be able to smile and laugh again. She told her partners at the Denver Post she didn't know about the bullying until after her son's death when she found messages from at least five teens. She then made a call for action, asking both the Greenwood Village Police to investigate and the Cherry Creek School District to expel, quote, the bullies who repeatedly wrote to our son telling him to kill himself and told him they were bringing a gun to school to shoot and kill him. Jack's friends are tired of living in devastation. Tragically, Jack's was one of two this semester at Cherry Creek High. And so they'll make sure Jack's death will never be in vain. It's making sure that other people realize how much I appreciate them. If you're getting bullied, you're not going to like, and you don't think you're worth it, you're not going to reach out. So I just want like, personally, I just want the school to reach out to the students a little more. The Cherry Creek School District in a statement says that no student reported any bullying until after Jack's death. They also are working closely, they say, with police looking into these bullying allegations. And his friends and family have started a movement called Jack Strong 17. It's raised nearly $40,000 for a nonprofit to fund teen suicide awareness and prevention. Uh, they have these bracelets you can see behind me. They've got an Instagram account and they go all over the country snapping photo photos in the studio. Oh. Jackie Crea, Denver 7, guys. Oh, Tragic. Jackie. So right. sad. Thank Thanks you, Jackie. for sharing that story. And if you need someone to talk to or you are feeling alone, please do not hesitate to reach out. Colorado Crisis Services is always there to